Hey, we've moved to our next project now. You're gonna see a major makeover right here. We're gonna tear all this deck out, get rid of the banana trees here, really transplant them, come back with the new eight foot high seawall in front right here with the new boat lift and dock situation. Uh, wear deck on it, you're gonna see it's gonna look really good. Everything you see here is gonna be coming out. Seawall, there's a uh, concrete block retaining wall behind it right there. All these decks all the way up to the house going to be a major transformation on this project right here. Here's the upland side of the project. Once the demo done, we're wrapping it up now. I'll get ready to get over to the dumpster. The pile on the barge to fix the unload. Here's the first. We got the uh, whole dock out, boathouse out. Now we're getting ready to start with our uh, vinyl seawall. We're just going to join in over here. And that is a universal corner right there, connected to absolutely nothing. So I don't know what the purpose of even putting that corner in there was for. Getting started this morning, we're claiming some eight foot vinyl. We've got 70 foot of it, all of it's in pretty good shape. got a survey pulled yesterday on the customer's property here and realized that the uh, neighbor's wall is over about a foot to a foot and a half on the property line. So I met with him yesterday, discussed what the options are as far as getting this wall out and getting it moved over. He agreed with it. So what we're going to do, we're going to remove all this return wall right here, take one sheet off the front, run it back to our wall, and our wall needs to come another foot and a half past these pilings now. So we'll add on to these uh, whalers, scab back further, back that way, add on to them. And get that installed. Got a new uh, member team out here. This is Gatlin. Call him Gat. He's learning the ropes right now. It's a black German Shepherd. Gatlin. Here. Already knows his name. Eight weeks old. Pretty good. We're claiming some heavy duty 10 foot vinyl seawall. to um, reinstall a new one for them since we're disturbing it. Put one back 12 foot behind the wall. Do it properly so it works. All right, we're uh, removing the sheets on this. And it looks like they're about 16 foot long. Some of them are, it's crazy. Some more vinyl headed to the uh, reclaim yard. Heavy duty thick bottle here. It's about half inch thick, close to it. Looks like they're close to 14 to 16 foot long sheets. Got a few of them. Come on. Are you scared? Come on. Come on, Gallon. Here. Come on. Come on. Come on. <laughs> now the fun part of the job here, you never know what's been buried behind the wall. We're trying to do a return wall, tie back wall in here. We ran into some concrete down there. What I think it is is some of the leftover blocks off of this block wall down here. They just slew down the hole, but you gotta wash it out trying to get pulled out of there. Guys are on the top doing upper deck now. It's a 10 by 47 foot deck on the back of the house. We've got a strap tied to it, picked it up with a track hoe. There it is right there. Big old chunk of concrete. Careful right there, but wasn't no way pulling that thing out. Now we're gonna go ahead and proceed and put the return wall in. You got to go, Smiles? Yep. Beat. Yes, sir. We got the one piece out of the way and we got further back and there's more of the same stuff. It's like a long concrete wall here one time, so we're going to try to get that yanked out of there without destroying this upland wall. Get chained around and we'll pull it out with 
Alright, we did a little jetting on it, a little chaining on it, pulling on it. We got it yanked out of the way, so at least we can get our uh, wall put in there. Alright, we just had a YouTube uh, fan, I guess you would say, or guy that follows my page, send us some money so we could get the crew some lunch. So look, we got Papa John's Pizza. Thanks a lot, Brandon. We appreciate that, man. Yes. Appreciate that. We always appreciate the freebies. And uh, we're going to go ahead and say a quick prayer of it real quick. Right, let's pray. Father God, we thank you for this day. Father God, we ask that you please bless this food. And uh, we just thank you for all that you do for us. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen, Amen. Amen. man. Now, y'all enjoy the lunch. Let's break it up and see thank what we you. got. Thank, thank you. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> got smiles and a drink. <laughs> Look at that. We had some filter cloth down there and some sea wall piling during the way. So now we just got to jump down the water. Try to chain it up and get it out of there. It's right in the way of the vinyl sheet piles. John's figuring out a way to get it done. set up setting the uh, poles for the boathouse and for the dock. The guys are loving all the dirt in the back right now. That barge. <laughs> I gotta catch my breath. Can you reach the bottom? <laughs> yeah, my toes are touching. Cool. <laughs> Smile, you want to get in? <laughs> no. <laughs> Wall completed on this project here. Got it back filled, tied back. Now we're starting on the um, framing of the dock. You see, we've got the poles in already. We're going to start framing a walkway around and we'll get on with the uh, boat lift. 10,000 pound golden sea drive boat lift going in and a hip style boathouse. Completed product turned out really good. Do work. Oh, thank you. You say that again. You, you say that again out loud. I have if to you want commend to. you on that. <laughs> it's, it's the whole crew. Thank you. Especially who? Especially me? Especially Dale and Chase. Dale and Chase. Oh, and Chase. Well, good. Best workers ever. Well, thank you. And your salesman? Estimator? Oh, Est Jeremy. Estimator? Jeremy, the best? Oh, yeah. <laughs> good deal. Got Chief doing the final inspection, too. Well, that is great to hear. A major makeover. Nice wide five foot set of stairs. We've got cable rail system coming in, type 316 stainless steel cable. We'll go through all the pilings also. Have the right tools. Have Absolutely. The right equipment to know how. 10,000 pound golden sea drive, aluminum boat lift installed in the boathouse. Notice the boathouse is all clear up top so no birds can roost in it. Mess on the boat. Great job by my electrician getting everything installed. The boat uh, lift set up for a pontoon boat. You approved, Chief? Huh? It's Chief approved. Yeah. <laughs> everybody, everybody on YouTube loves Chief. Here's a quick look at the project we're working on next. It's about a 300 foot wood retainer wall, upland wood retainer wall. Put the ball cutting in now. I got some of the filter cloth installed, and you can see it goes way on down there. Hopefully, get this one here wrapped up by the end of the year. If not, we'll be back on it. After January 2nd, we're going to give the guys a week off, actually taking off this Friday and all next week for a good Christmas break.
Hey guys, I appreciate y'all taking time to check out my page. Hope y'all learned something from it and kind of give you ideas what you want to do with your own project. Also, want to give a shout out to uh, one of the YouTube followers that called my guys out on no hard hats. We've always been pretty frequent on wearing hard hats, but it got a little lazy on it. So, got them some new hard hats for Christmas, and they're all going to be sporting brand new hard hats. So, all my crews are supposed to wear hard hats anytime equipment's moving or running around. So, I like to keep them safe, keep everybody uh, healthy, and hope you all have a happy, merry Christmas and a prosperous new year. If you haven't subscribed to the page yet, please do so. Give me a thumbs up and comment if you got one. Thanks. Do you like Whataburger? Do you want some Whataburger? Yes. There. There you go.